77 grams of silver alloy and 45 milliliters of distilled water, 40 mil of 68% nitric acid. Turn the heat off, vigorous reaction. Nitric, nitric acid and distilled water. Looking for my lab partner. Here we are with Saturday morning rainy day chemistry for Carolyn Wright. This video is coming to you from wonderful Ashland, Virginia. And I've got to add a little bit of water to this. All right, see you later. Silver's falling off. Had a little scare. Had some tungsten. Kind of muddied up things, but it filtered out real nice. Thanks. Hey, Adam. How's that look, bud? Silver's starting to cement out there. We're good to go. We're going to add another 163 grams of silver to this and let it roll. So far, 262 grams of silver recovered from the silver cell number five. And what I have here in the anode baskets are two bars of impure silver I had poured. And I had just added some more nitric acid and a little bit of silver solution to this um, cell right here to help it along um, and we'll see what we have tomorrow thanks guys
Hello, YouTubers. Welcome to my channel. This is the last of that shot I poured in here. And, uh, man, this stuff really looks nice. Got a little piece stuck together. It's probably going to have to be redone. But that's, uh, look at that, man. It's a uh, pretty nice in my fluorescent dimly lit garage. Um, some really nice pieces in that. Waiting on my rounded 50 gram bar to come from China. It's due to get here February 19th. So I decided to put the crystal into shot just to keep, if I, if I spill it, man, it's going to be all over the place. This will be a little easier to find, I think. So anyway, that's what we got, man. That's I'll get a weight on it, and uh, I've got some cement silver to clean up too, but that's it. Thanks for watching. Please hit the like, subscribe, share. That's all, folks. This is silver cell number four. It's got 400 grams, 418 grams of impure shot, 150 grams of pure shot in solution. It's a one liter cell. And we're about 17 seconds in. Thanks. All right. Welcome to my channel. We are going to be doing a little maintenance on the silver cell today. It's been in operation for about a little less than 24 hours. And um, what we're going to do here is knock these crystals down. They're growing a little fast and a little thin. The power supply I got from Amazon for Christmas uh, isn't working out the way I wanted and uh, I had to re result or you know use my old reliable but the problem with that is the voltage and really the current it does about half amp on this and it's really not enough to make the big crystals that we all like these are a little spindly but we're going to knock them down and uh, you know We'll just pour a bar out of them, but I had to knock them down. You can see I might have to harvest them. Anyway, that's uh, silver cell in operation. And you guys hit like and subscribe if you like, and uh, I'll see you guys uh, later. Thanks. Welcome back to my channel. I've added a 300 pound, 300 pound stop. Hello YouTubers, welcome to my channel. This is a silver cell, it's been going on for, I don't know, almost a week. And so what I thought I'd do is show you how the crystal growth is coming along and just close it up real fast. It's starting to look pretty good. Crystals are really big. I'll try and get you a close up without getting solution on you. So there it is, it's rolling along. Right about 1.75 amps, excuse me, volts, 1.3 amps, and running about 2.2 watts. And, uh, whoa, whoa, get a little vertigo. There's a couple of copper cells in the background. The one on the right's been deactivated for a little while. Thanks. Hello, YouTubers, welcome to my channel. I am continuing to use the electrolyte from silver cell number five. I had put a titanium cathode right here with a piece of stainless steel that has a tape wrapped around it. And um, I had to knock the crystal down here. There's a 200 gram bar in there right now for the anode material. And we are developing really good crystals in the bottom here. And, uh, so we'll try and get ring out the rest of this electrolyte. Maybe afterwards try and recover the copper out of the solution and recover that nitric acid. We'll see where we're going to go with that. But we're going to try and ring out as much silver as possible. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. Thanks. Hello, YouTube. Welcome to my channel. Uh, we're looking at a little bit of silver growth here. Just knocking down some of the bigger crystals to keep it from shorting out my anode. Look at that. Man, that crystal growth really is starting to look good. 
kind of don't want to knock some down, but I don't want to have that trouble later. We'll let it grow some more tonight, but it really is coming along. Thanks for viewing. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Thanks, guys. Yeah.